Leila, Lexi, we need to go. We need to go. We need to go. Come on. What are you doing here? They're my kids now. You can't have them. They're my kids. You better leave them with my kids now. You can't. Now! What are you doing here? What are you doing in my house? You don't have a humidifier? I called Buma, not you. To answer your stupid question, Buma is my husband. His business is my business. I see that life is treating you really well. I mean, for your standard, that is what you deserve. You told my husband that you were suffering. And from what I see, Looks like you didn't tell the truth. Leave my house. <laughs> I get it. You wanted him to come, so you tried to seduce him. <sighs> it won't work. Mm -hmm. Hey, baby. Are you okay? What do you want? I need to have snacks. Okay, baby, you want something in the kitchen, okay? Go ahead. Get out of my house. Just stay the hell away from my house. Get out of my house! Get out! 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 She has to be the biggest hypocrite ever. After stealing your husband, how dare she? They both suit each other. I don't even care about them. I just regret calling him for child support. I'm never doing that ever again. How I wish your business was working. You will never have to ask him for peanuts. Blessing, I'm so angry with myself. I can't even afford to feed my children. It's okay, it's okay. Don't cry, please. Don't don't even cry. What did I do wrong? Where did I where did I go wrong? I got married like everyone else. I had two beautiful daughters. And my life still turned out like this. I mean, you did everything right. Darling, how are, you, how, how are you supposed to know that your best friend was a snake who wanted your husband for herself? I've moved on from that. It's been over two and a half years. <sighs> Me too. Look, I'll talk to my colleagues tomorrow about your business and see if anyone is interested. You will do that. Thank you so much, Blessing. Thank you. Anytime, babe. Anytime. Hi, right, good night.
be. Hey. I had a terrible dream. It was so terrible. I saw you with... It was a dream, right? The doctor said you were stressed, that's why you collapsed. I saw wrong, right? I, I didn't see you and Crystal on our matrimonial bed. It had to be a dream. <clears throat> I am. Um... I love her. We've been together for more than a year now and I'm convinced she's the one I want to spend the rest of my life with. I know that this will come as a shock to you because you two are best friends, but that's the way it is. You. You were cheating on me with my best friend? We're in love. Puma! We have two beautiful daughters. A three months old baby. <laughs> and, you're, and you're cheating on me with my best friend. How could you? I'm sorry. I found the love of my life. You guys should set up that meeting. Once we're done with that one, then I'll be ready for my meeting by noon. Okay. Yeah, no, that's fine. That's fine. Make sure that we all get there on time, okay? I don't want any stories, though. Son, I made you a refreshing cup of tea. My dear mother. How are you? <laughs> I'm fine. Hmm. What did I tell you hmm? about staying here? I am not cooking anything. I just made you a cup of tea. Ah, I said no cooking. It's the same thing. You know, if you're... Oh. I will see you later. I know Yo. what you're about to say. I know what you're about to say. I will drink it later. <sighs> I'll take it myself then. Babe, have I told you how much I love you? No. I love you so much. Thank you so much. I promise I would not disappoint you. I trust you won't. I was so happy when my boss asked if I knew a fashion consultant. I'm like, <laughs> I literally had to restrain myself Thank you. from gushing. Um, the meeting is for noon. Okay, my love. Okay, all right. Love you. Bye. All right. Bye. <laughs> Hello? What? I'll, I'll be right there. Oh, my God. Yeah, come in. Uh, let me guess, my twelve is here, right? Not yet, sir. Why not? I've been trying to reach her, but she's not available. This is 12.30. Yeah. 
If she's not picking up, just call the next person. Oh, okay, sir. Amelia is a very smart and beautiful girl. Yes. <laughs> you want to know my son more than me? <laughs> of course. Okay, let me call you later. What you just got in? Hey, mother. Hi. How are How was you? Today? Ah, <laughs> it was alright. Hey, you good? Yeah, I was good. Great. <laughs> you look happy. How am I not always happy? Yeah, but then this one is kind of like different. What's going on? Oh, Mom, I don't know how to guess. Just tell me. Guess. You know Miss Evelyn's daughter? Mm -mm. What's that? The one you used to play around with when you were a kid. Oh, the one that broke my head with a stone. <laughs> that was a long time ago. Yeah, but I'm the one living with the PTSD. Still remember You're everything. You're all grown up now. Mom, anyway, you had a good day, right? I have a meeting that I must attend. I need to go freshen up. Well, you just got back. I'll talk to you later. Hmm? I know there will be a great match. Hello. Oh, I'm so sorry. Let me just stay no, down. No, 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 no. Let us stay. Um, are you sure? Yeah, let us. How are you doing? Oh, good. I tried to keep having a secretary, but she refused. <laughs> Kids can be very picky. I apologize for bringing her with me. It's just that she's been ill, so I couldn't take her to school. Oh. That's why you couldn't make the last meeting, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. I see. Sorry about that. Thank you so much for your understanding. It's fine. Let's get down to business. Sure. So, as you know, I'm a real estate developer. And at this stage of my business, I want to rebrand. But rebranding starts with the owner of the company, right? Because it's the image you put that the company will follow. Mm -hmm. So, I want to rebrand. Do you think you're the right person for the job? I think you've made a great choice hiring me. A lot of clients I've worked for have been satisfied with my service. Mm. I mean, but then if you talk about the number of clients you've worked for, your company is just what, how many years old? Yes. You've worked with so many clients? Yes, but even when I was working nine to five, I've always consulted. I just decided to make it my full-time job. Oh, I see. I guess we're in business then. Yes. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Hi, darling. Don't worry, you'll feel better soon, okay? Okay. Ice cream? Me. <laughs> All right. All right. Thank you. Take care. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. Odi? Oh, hey, welcome, son. <laughs> how, was your, how was your day? Fine. How was your day? Fine. Guess who came to visit? Who? Oh. It's a surprise. Mom, I'm too tired for this one. Who came? It's a surprise. Mom, you're not the surprises. <laughs> surprise! <laughs> No, it's, it's fine, it's fine. Mom, uh, excuse me. Can I have a seat? Oh, dear. I can just do that to her without talking to her. What do you mean? I don't know her. Who is she? I don't. So you still hold a grudge? Yeah? Because you hit your head with a stone when you're Mom, a child. I am not interested. Why would you bring her here? How would you be interested? Why? You have someone else? No. I don't know her. Who is she? I'm not interested. Please. 
place. Get to know her. Okay, you know what? Let me go upstairs and freshen up. I'll come back down then. Okay. <laughs> Amelia. <laughs> come. Let me get you a drink. <laughs> have a seat. He'll be back soon. Ah, so. Have such a lovely house. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> what do you like to drink? Anything soft. Orange juice, water. Orange juice is good. All right. I'll be back. No, no, just sit down. I'll be back. Why do you want to sell your car? How are you going to manage with the children? We'll take care. And besides, I already spoke to the school. They'll start using the school bus. But wasn't it better when you were picking them up and dropping them off? It was. Blessing, I barely have 200,000 in my account. I'm trying to manage. It's okay. You look tired. You need to get some rest. Yeah. Lena didn't sleep last night. I hope she's not sick again. She just decided that it was time to play and she didn't sleep till like 5 a.m. <laughs> my dear, you need to get a nanny. You can't continue like this. How far will your nanny search? The agent said he hasn't been able to see someone. Girl, I'm tired. See, see single mothers, they are the real MVP. I know. I agree. But you need to reach out to Boma. Honestly, you can't continue like this. I even regret calling Boma concerning child support. He sent that two-faced snake to my house. Now, wow. Well, I don't understand men, though. I mean, these are his children now. Even if he doesn't want to see you, he should see his kids. He has not seen the kids since he remarried and, and, and just moved in with his wife. I don't even understand. Are you sure? Still no with Claire Ayo. Maybe it's Crystal's doing. Did she tell him not to see his kids? Even when uh, Lexi was crying then, oh, I want to see daddy, I want to see daddy. What did he do? Okay, thank you everyone. All right. Bye. I'm so sorry. I didn't know this meeting was going to take this long. It's fine. Right. Okay. So what are we doing today? Um, in our last meeting, we agreed on merging native designs with Western. Yes, we did. We did. What do you have for me then? I've been able to reach out to reliable brands I've worked with in the past. Okay. You have stuff for me to look at? Actually, two of the brands just launched their ready-to-wear collection. Mm. And I have some of the designs. Let me show oh, you. Let me see. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, this one. I want this one. Why are you smiling? Because we agree that you should only wear colors that flatter your skin. This doesn't flatter your skin tone. I'm sorry. So which one flatters my skin to? I already ordered one in a suitable color. Okay. Yeah. Boss. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just leave everything to me and you should be good. When will okay. they deliver? As soon as possible. I don't even want to worry about it. You're in charge. Whatever you say is fine. Okay, but well, just look at this. Okay. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I like the can... monochrome thing going on here. You can, there you go. All right. Yeah. You should be as good as you say you are. <laughs> Thank you. Oh yeah? Well, what are you doing here? Why didn't you take a cab or something? Or your car? I thought you had a car. It's the same. 
Um, no. I had one, but not anymore. Oh, I see. Oh, okay. Um, so I actually booked a ride, but he said he had, I don't know, he packed up. So I'm trying to book another one. Oh, I see. But I'm not going to the office. I'm headed home. I brought your clothes and I wanted you to try them on. Why don't we go to my house and I try it on there? Your house? Yeah. Don't worry, my mom is in the house. Is she thinking? No, I'm not thinking anything. Okay, so let's go then. Okay, sure. Yeah, let me help you with your bag. Okay, sure. Do you want anything? No, I'm fine, thank you. Okay. Hello, Good dear. Good afternoon, ma. Good afternoon. You must be Odie's friend? Um, I'm his fashion consultant. Fashion consultant. That has a very nice ring to it. <laughs> and he just left you here without offering you anything. No, I told him I don't want anything. Are you sure? Yes, ma'am. All right. Thank you, ma'am. Excuse me. Yes. <laughs> Come in. Odi. Ah, mommy. How are you? I didn't see you when I came in. I just saw a beautiful damsel downstairs. Oh my god, mommy, please. Don't start. <laughs> She's Yes, your fashion consultant. I know. And who cares? Look, that's how people meet their spouses. Mommy, she's here because I need to do fitting. That's why she's here. Nothing more. She's Mom. very beautiful. Mommy, I want to, I want to change. Consider it. Hmm? <laughs> Mommy, go now. I want to change. Uh -uh. Okay, all right. I'm gone. I'm gone. Hmm. <sighs> Ooh, you look good. This is so nice. Uh -uh. So nice turn. Uh -uh. It looks perfect. <laughs> so nice. Honestly. What about this? This is it okay? Yeah, it's fine. We don't want it too tight. I love it. Mom, love mom. <laughs> um, could you just. Don't you have something else to do? Odi, let me be. I want in on the show. It's not a show, it's business. Everything is business to you. As far as I'm concerned, I'm not disturbing anybody. I'll be at this one. Am I disturbing you? No, you're not. I'm even glad you're here. Uh -huh. You so see, helpful. she said that my being here is very helpful. What was she saying? Ah, ah. Oh, where the other one, Jerry? Yes, but this color looks good on you. We're going to add it to the collection. In fact, this is so perfect. Yeah, perfect. This one, I love your work. Thank you, Mom. You're so creative. Thank you. Wow, look at this. I look at this. I knew it was your color. I knew it. Fantastic. <laughs> what do you, so what, but what about this sleeves? Is that a style? It's, it's nice. Just, it's fine. Give me a second. Wow. Let me check it again. You are going to be designing some few clothes for me. Hmm? 
<laughs> you know what I would like. Yes. <laughs> okay. Uh, Thank you. Yes, it's it's in fact perfect fit. Yeah, take your flower. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. Wow, what took you so long? No. I'm sorry, we had a lot of outfit change. Mm -hmm. How did it go? It went well. How are the girls? Oh, um, uh, they have to bed, thankfully. Those girls are a handful, though. How do you do it? I'm sorry, love. I know fit. I was almost pulling out my hair at some point. It stressed me out. Hey, God. And why does Lexi like to compete with Leila? Doesn't she know she's the baby of the house? I know. They have their moments, but they love each other. If they try, you, oh, I can't. Ha -ha. Hey. Thanks, baby. Thanks for helping me. I owe you one billion. Let me go and check on them. Yeah? I'm going to cash that check. This one billion. <laughs> <laughs> Well done. I don't think I can go home right now. I'll break. I'll sleep here. So, Mr. Martin, thank you for your interest in power buying. I promise we won't let you down. Uh, it's all right. Uh, apparently, you came highly recommended. Yeah, I saw the other states that are under your umbrella. Yes. You did a massive work, bro. You're good at what you do. Thank you, sir. It's all right. It's all right. And one more thing. I've been meaning to ask you that, that outfit. The, oh, the, this, this the one, one I wore at the presentation? Yeah, yeah. Where did you get it from? So I have a fashion consultant now. Oh, really? Yeah, she's responsible for all my outfits. Wow. That's so nice. Yes. You know, right from that moment, I said, I must do business with this man. Yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, sir. It's, it's all right. It's all right. I would want us to really talk more. We, we need to do business. I would schedule a meeting with your office in the morning and then. Oh, we we'll take it from there. Amazing. Thank yeah. you so much. I really appreciate it. I think we're done here. <laughs> Thank you so much. Sir. Thank you, Ms. Naudi. Do not forget it. I will send you her contact. Thank you. All right. Take care of yourself. Yes, sir. But then eventually they gave me the call oh, and I got the deal. I'm so happy for you. <laughs> so, how is it going to be so just thank her? Thank her? Yeah. I mean, she's instrumental to all of this. If she just had to style me differently, that guy told me that he saw me at the conference and he saw what I was wearing and he loved it. That's how he came to her office. Wow, I think so too. Ah, no, mom, why don't we have like a dinner? Nice restaurant. What do you think? Mm. Don't you think it's a bit too expensive? Why not have dinner here at home? Dinner here? She's married now. What would I was about to say? Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. We can have lunch instead. Lunch here? Okay. We can do that. Mom! This is your boy. <laughs> Let's clock this one. I know. Let's clock this one. <laughs> Misconceptions. Mm -hmm. Even me, I had it the whole time about this fashion thing. Till you started telling me stuff. So, fashion is mostly underrated by people. People do not know that style adds to the way you're perceived, you know? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I agree with you. You know, when I was younger, 
I used to be a fashion girl. I still am. Mm. <laughs> it's just a pity that my son didn't pick up those traits for me. Okay, okay, fine. Yeah, I give, I give it to her. I mean, look at her picture there. Yeah. Still very fashionable with the hat. <laughs> I see it now. So fashion is way more than just clothing. It's mm -hmm. a reflection of people's attributes, styles, belief. Through your dressing, you can communicate your social status and your personality. Mom, um, see, I had right. How did you even get into fashion? Oh, mm -hmm. when I was young. Mm -hmm. I used to like dressing up, right? So I just knew that I needed to be a fashion designer. Oh. But I failed at my first attempt. <laughs> <laughs> and something kept pulling me to fashion. And I just knew that I wanted to be a fashion consultant. And it just flowed. You're killing it now. Thank <laughs> you. Well done. How's well Leah, by the way? She's great. My friend is with them. Mm -hmm. Right. Oh, she's fine. Lex is fine. Huh? Huh? Oh my god, are you okay? Come, come, come. Oh my god. Thank god, are you okay? Hello? Hi, Adispa. Yeah, I was calling to reschedule our meeting to this morning because I have something else I need to do later in the day. Hello, Odi. Did I wake you? Are you okay? No, I'm awake. You were saying? I was talking about our meeting. Can we reschedule? Because I need to do something else later. I'm so sorry. I wanted to call to cancel. Oh, is there any problem? I am with Leila at the hospital. We've been here all night. Wow. What's wrong? I'll call to reschedule. No, no, that's fine. Just, just take your time. Take your time. Sorry about that. All right, bye. Okay, bye. Kids. Kids. Where's my remote? I couldn't sleep last night. Lila was running temperature. What kind of bacteria is this one? I hope you have been giving her her medication, the one prescribed by the doctor. Yeah, she's getting better, but not at the pace I expected. Maybe you should get a second opinion. Try another hospital. I thought of that, but they don't really have reason. this hospital for a while, so... It's not easy. Oh, it's my, it's my client, Audi. One second. Hello? Hi, Adisua. I'm sorry, I didn't know if this was the right time to call. I just decided to call. How are you and the kids? Um, The kids are fine. I'll just call to check on you guys. <laughs> yes, I'll tell them. No, I'll take care now. Bye. Thank you so much for checking in. Oh. Alright, I'll I'll see bye. I'll say hi to them. Alright, bye. Odi. Yes, Odi. Be Odi. Just check in. Just see, you see this Tule collection, eh? I, I love it. I like it too, but it's giving that stiffness vibe. I want something a bit more relaxing and business at the same time. Like, you know, mm -hmm. I know you don't understand what I'm talking about. You just... <laughs> what? How to not just look like I'm intelligent. No, it's fine. If you don't understand, feel free to ask me. No, I trust you. Joking. Anything you say is fine. Excuse me, it's my kid's school. Oh, okay, go ahead. Hello? Oh, it's today. School is closed. Okay, I'll be right there. 
What's up with the kids? I forgot today's open day celebration, so they close early. Oh, so you have to leave now, yes? Yes, but we also have to finalize what you're wearing on Wednesday. And I also have to call designers. Why don't we do this? We go pick your kids. Take them home. But all through the drive, we'll continue meeting. You do that? Why not? Thank you so much. It's a deal. Yeah, thank you. Good. Give me a moment, let me pack up here, then I'll join you. Um, guys, um, I'm so sorry. What do you say to Uncle for bringing us home? Thank you. Thank you, Uncle. You're welcome, Lexi. Uh, You're welcome, guys. Let me just let me just take them inside and freshen them up. You're okay. Uh, let's go, let's go. Baby, let's go find out our clothes. Sorry. It's, it's okay. <laughs> you, you don't really need to apologize. You're a woman, so and you're a mother. This thing is come with the territory. Um, it was too late last night. I couldn't clear the cluster, so yeah. It's okay. It's, it's, it's okay. Uh, please sit. <laughs> Make yourself comfortable. Thank you. Um, I'm so sorry once again. No, don't need to apologize. You're a mother. These things happen. Thank you so much for understanding. Not every client would understand. I know. Yeah. You don't have anyone helping you out? No. It's not easy getting a nanny. And I always like to get them when I'm less busy from work oh. so I can monitor them and, I mean, before I entrust my kids into their hands. You know? Makes sense. What about their dad? I, I didn't need to pry. I'm just, I just want to know if he's helping out, you know? We got divorced three years ago. Oh, oh no, so sorry. Um, is he filing for custody or is he contributing and helping? Ouch, that can be tough. <laughs> it's pretty easy. I mean, it's pretty easy juggling work, the kids. It's just that sometimes it gets overwhelming when you mm. get fall ill, you know, because I don't have any help and yeah. stuff. But other than that, it's fine. I mean, you're a strong woman. <laughs> well done. Um, okay. Um, so let's get back to business. Okay, okay, okay. Um, so you were telling me about those designs. Yes, yeah, so I just think you need to just, you know, start like, you know, trying new things, new colors and... Okay, okay. That, that will work. Do you have any catalog? You probably send me the catalog list. Yes, I'll send you the list of things you need. Okay, okay. that's fine. That's fine. Um, it's okay. Um, <laughs> Do you need any help here? Um, no, no, no. Okay, I'll just follow you to the car to get their school bags. Oh, they okay. Left it. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. <laughs> um, so, babe, what are we going to do? We? What do you mean we? This is us. It's about us. Well, I'm not sterile. I already have kids. Do you have to always bring it up to let me know that you already have kids? I'm talking about our own kids. Yeah, well, you heard the doctor. You have fertility issues. That can be fixed. Didn't you understand what that man said? You cannot have kids. It's... Look, babe, don't be insensitive. I'm, I'm, I'm sure that, I'm sure there's definitely a way out. You know what? What, my love? I know we're gonna go on this your meet and greet with your fertility people, I'm done. Yeah. I don't care what's that supposed to mean, look, we're a couple. I already have kids, yeah. don't you get it? I, I, I don't care, they don't, they, they, they don't exist to me. I'm talking about our own kids. Jeez. Being, but my, we're a couple. You're being deliberately obtuse. No, 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 no. But my, we're a couple. 
And I'm talking about our own children. I already have kids. They, 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 Part of that, don't you understand? So what about us? Babe. No, babe, you can't be driving off. Now we're going to see the doctor. No. I'm done. I'm done with this thing. You no, know, you're not done. You can't be done. Puma. Puma, look into my eyes. Puma, I'm talking to you. Baby. Baby. Mm. I like this one. I like this. I like this one as well. Please, um, excuse me. Oh, go on, go on. Hello? What do you want? I need to see you. I am at work. I can't talk. I want to see you now, this one. You have to make out time for me. Make it quick. I want to see the kids. What are you talking about? What kids? I haven't seen them after the divorce. I want to see them. You haven't seen the kids in two years. They don't know you. I'm their father. You might as well be the spam donor. You haven't contributed a dime ever since we went our separate ways. Things are going to change from now on. I'll make sure of that, okay? Are you trying to be daft or are you trying to piss me off? Like, you've just went out of your life. Now you want to play dad? You must be joking. Just... <laughs> So just, you're just going to give me that kind of response you want me to run with it? Really? Text me, I'm a good listener. Um, it's just that... It's personal stuff. Whoa. Personal stuff. I think it's personal level. I mean, you've been to my house. I've been to your house. You met my mom. Why are you sounding like there's something serious going on between us? So he wants to meet the kids. What do you feel about that? I don't want him anywhere near my kids. So tell him. I don't, I don't know what he's, why he's so interested in them now. You know, like he, he has a wife, he has a new family. Mm -hmm. I don't know, you just focus there. See, in life, man, we rush into decisions. We realize these mistakes that we've made. And then we regret them. I'm sure that's what's going on with him. I don't just want him anywhere near my kids. I get it, he's their father, right? And, but I'm their mother. It's my duty to protect them. I know, see, listen. You're doing a fine job as a mother with the kids. Don't let him mess you up. And don't let him ruin that, okay? Yeah, okay. Hey, what's up? Hey, I'm so sorry I'm calling late. What do you think? I'm so sorry. I was just working on you, your altitude for the next three months and I thought to bounce off ideas with you. Hmm. Okay. Are you sure you're not busy? What do you expect? That I'll be in bed with a woman? <sighs> Audi! You say the weirdest things. <laughs> Sorry, that came out wrong. Who says that's his fashion consultant? I just feel like, you know, we've been working together for more than a month and then all this... Work, work, work. We just keep talking about work. Nothing else. I thought to achieve that day. Eh? What's that noise? I don't know. I think someone is knocking at the door. Let me call you back. Uh, at this time of the night? Yes, I don't know what's going on. What are you doing here? 
like that. I just came to see my girls, man. How dare you? How did you get my address? <laughs> <laughs> well, baby, you know, like, what am I saying? The world's a small place, and that's how I got it, baby. The world is such a small place. Hello? Adi? Ah! Don't touch me! Adi! Oh boy! Yeah, no. Oh, fuck. This is such a nice comfy couch. You know? Oh, no. Question is done for you. Why are you here? Excuse me. You're excused. Yes, what? You have no right to call her name. Oh, well, listen, I have every right. I'm my ex husband. Ex, you said. Made you in the past. And that's where you stay. Get out of here. I'm not finished here. I deserve to see my kids, and I will. Get your lawyer, then we start talking. This one. Guy, get out of here. Okay. Thank you enough. It's fine. Um, Where are the kids? They're in your room watching cartoon. You see that your security? He needs to be fired. How does it let this guy come in at that time of the night? I know. I'll call the estate security later. I couldn't believe it. I was shocked. Good thing is that you're fine. Hmm? Um, you slept here last night. I hope you caught some sleep. A little bit. I'm sorry for the inconvenience. I'm sure your mom is worried sick because you didn't sleep at home. She didn't even know when I left. Oh. Let's go make breakfast for the kids. Okay. Wow. He must be such a kind-hearted person. If kindness was a person, it would be odd. Well, it's right to see nice people in this world who, you know, do good things without any strings attached. There are still good people in this world, you know. I'm just thinking, I wish I was here when he walked in. When Boma <laughs> walked in and saw a man, like a man. It was hilarious, like I was like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's so sweet meal? I love it. I love it for you. You know, it's good to be surrounded with like, you know, good people. And when I mean good people, I mean like a man, like a great guy with some testosterone walking around this place. Yeah, yeah, I'm just loyal to my babes, really. I mean, for like, what do you mean? Don't tell me you're not considering settling down again. Marriage. Yes. Me. Who marry a woman with two kids? What, what is wrong with you? Why are you looking down on yourself? You are the prize, oh. Uh. You have to know that you are the prize. I think I want to go and fry for eating. Why don't you fry for for eating? Are you eating? eating? <laughs> Sit down here. Where are you running to? We must, we must talk about this thing. Oh, bless you. have to think about settling down. Hey. Hey, buddy. How are you doing? I'm good. Uh, let's... Got this for you. Really? Yes. Yeah. So much. 
She said. <laughs> Hi, the girls. They're having a nap. Oh. Yeah. What are you doing here? Uh, I, I was just in the neighborhood and I thought to invite you to the beach. I don't understand. I was thinking um, maybe you and the girls might want to come with me to the beach. The thing is, I, I like going to the beach a lot, but not alone. So maybe you want to come? Okay. Sure. Okay. Mm. Uh, tomorrow? Yeah, tomorrow. Okay, cool. I hope you like those things though. Yes, I do. <laughs> it's a lot. It's a lot. Thank nah, you. It's not a lot. It's just okay. Oh my god. Mm. Now wow. This guy really likes to share. Oh stop it. I'm serious. Like, who offers to take a single mother and her children to the beach just because? I mean, is he an discussion or what? He likes you, Joe. Maybe he just pities me. Or maybe because I'm his fashion consultant. Hmm. No way. Wait, though. Is that you think it's not possible that he can be into you or what? No. Please stop. Never. He hey. just loves kids. Girl, have you seen you? Do you know how beautiful you are? Look at how amazing you are with your children. What's not to love? Tell me. Anyways, if you say so, I don't know. I bet she's my third style. Mm -hmm. My third is tired. Special consultant. Thank you so much. Did you have fun, Thanks. girls? Yes, mommy. What do you say to uncle? Thank you, uncle. Uh, come on, you guys are welcome. OK, let All me go time. freshen them up. That's fine. Right, I'll okay, be here. Let's go. Favorite show? Um, you know what? Let me. Pick. I love K dramas. Oh really? Yeah. Well, let me let me pick this time around. Trust me, sorry. Um, 
do you like Nigerian stuff? Yeah, I do. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I do. <laughs> like, I just watch K-Dramas a lot. Okay, but then there's some good stuff on YouTube. Nigerian stuff, good stuff. Okay. Yeah, you should see. Um, let's see this one. thinking can we grab dinner dinner with me yeah just, just the two of us but then the, the kids though my my friend she'll babysit oh okay cool so tomorrow night 7 p.m <laughs> yes it's a date there To think, come on now. This guy is obviously serious about you. <gasps> That's my problem with you, Nigerian girls. Mm. Once someone gives you small attention and friendship, it causes love. That's not the case. Okay, oh, anti Caribbean woman. You and I both know that's the case here because this guy is sweet, he's caring, except he's a player and I'm not aware. No, he's not a player. He just likes being around the kids. He just likes being around the kids. Why does he want to be around the kids? Simple. He wants to spend time with you. Duh. Please don't come and spoil my dinner with all these assumptions, God. okay? Hey. I'm not up for that. There's no way Odie is interested in me. Are you serious? Wait, why, why do you think Odie can't be interested in you? No, serious. Tell me. Or maybe I should rephrase the question. Are you into Odi? No, no. Hey, we are running. Okay. I'm here. Answer me, Joe. Answer me. It's crazy. Yeah. What about that stuff? Answer me. Answer me. You lay that place. <laughs> That dinner was amazing, thank you. And I like that you got this private space. I'm happy you like it. So growing up, tell me, how is it? <sighs> mm, growing up was fun as the only girl. Oh, yeah? I got away with so many things. And now my brothers are just flying around the world, except here. <laughs> Who wants to fly? I don't know. Yeah, I can't relate though. I grew up being the only child with my parents. For real? How did that feel? You felt know, good. You know, good. I got everything. I got all the attention. Nobody could compete with me. That's selfish. I know, I know. But I'm a grown man now. I want a family now. I want, I want a big family. A big family? How big? Three, four kids. Okay, now you're going to have a conversation with, with whoever you're in a relationship with. Because that's a lot. No problem. Mm, to be honest, four is not that big. Just that I think for me it's too many. So imagine if you have two kids, right? 
Mm-hmm. And then she gets pregnant again and you have kids. It's mm-hmm. for already. There's nothing you can do about it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Actually, very serious about what I said. I'm not trying to rush you or anything, but when a man sees what he likes, he goes for it. I like you at this way. I really do. I like your passion. You're so driven. The way you take your work, the way you love your kids. I really do like you. I, um, I, you don't have to respond now. Thank, thanks for dinner. I see what you do there. Awkward moment. Something about you that reminds me of flowers. Here's something to brighten your day and remind you of how beautiful you are. You had a busy week. Yes, yes, yes. Um, but I, I wanted to give you something. Something. What? You bought? No, I, I, I didn't buy. It. It's my second car. You can have. It. I hardly use it, so I just thought. No, oh dear, I can't. I can't. Take listen, this. listen. Getting around with the kids is stressful for you, and I know it. Okay, think about that time we went to the beach. If we didn't have a car, how would we go? Odi. You need it. Take it. You don't I already said made up my mind. I can't. Oh. Right. I understand. What do you understand? I never said anything. No, that you you, you don't you don't want me and you're not interested in Yes, I want it, and I like you very much, Oli. Say it again. I, I, I think I didn't hear you clearly. I like you very much, Oli. Very much. Come <laughs> here. What were you pretending before? I like you so much. Will you take the gift now? Yes. Who says no to your car? <laughs> Thank what you. What are you for me, Nishi? What are you for me? <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs>
Hey, mom. Hello, stranger. <laughs> How am I a stranger now? You're a stranger. Mm -hmm. Yes, because I hardly see you nowadays. Where do you go? Do you used to live here? Of course I do. Are you sure? Because it's very unlike you to spend your nights away from home. Or is there something that I should know? Something like what? I don't know. That's why I'm asking. Well, I have a girlfriend now. For real? No yes. jokes. And she's an amazing woman. <laughs> I love her already. You should meet her. <laughs> ah, so when am I going to meet her? I'm thinking maybe we can have dinner. Here. Yeah, yeah. I invite her over. Great. I'm going to tell Mabel to rustle up something. What do you want? Go in. Fine. Continental or you African? What do you want? What, is, what should I prepare? Give me a special. Oh, all right. <laughs> ah, is that food? Yes. Uh, not food in the kitchen. <laughs> <sighs> Babe, how do I look? You changed again. I thought the other one was too flashy. Babe, hey, come here. Come here. You're nervous. You've met my mom before. What's wrong with you? Babe, this time it's different. How is it different? She loves you. Listen, I guarantee you. Let me just change again. Like... Babe, the food is going to get cold. You want to eat cold food? Okay, true. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Pick up the kids from Blessing, right? No, they'll stay there till tomorrow. Huh. Maybe I might spend the night. Don't push it. Let's go. Oh. Okay. Mm. So I shouldn't spend the night. Babe, don't push it. Let's All right. go. All right. Here. Uh, hi. Hey, Mom. Hi. Adeswa, what do you... Oh, you have a meeting with Odi today? No, Mom. What's wrong with you? This is the girlfriend I spoke to you about. Come and sit. You sit where? Me. Sit where? How can she be your girlfriend when she's married? Okay. I didn't tell you. Update. She's no longer married. She's divorced. Two years ago, man. How can you bring another man's spoils into your own home? Mom. Look. Don't talk like that now. I'm going to pretend this never happened. Mom. Oh. Just. Mom! Mommy. Mom. Mom. Mom, what is this now? Mommy. Okay, so what if she's divorced? Then what? Huh. Odi, I can never allow you to marry a divorced woman. Not now, not ever. Mommy, she's kind and I love her. She's kind and you love her. You're just talking rubbish. I cannot stand women that will leave their homes for the comfort of outside. See, she left her first husband. What makes you think that she will not leave you too? She's not going to leave me. She will never leave me. You don't even know her story. <laughs> I don't know her story. How do you know she's not deceptive? Mommy, this girl is kind. She's warm. She's sweet. This girl is the girl that I want to marry. Why are you talking like this? There's nothing wrong with this girl. Because I can't. I cannot! What do I tell my friends? Eh? That my son married a divorced woman. What do I care about your friends? I will never agree to that. Never! Why, Why are your friends important in this conversation? Yeah, I've told you my own. I've said my mind. Look past her I'm not interested. Said it. This is unfair! What are you doing here? I'm here to see my kids. Your kids? You abandoned them? You think you can just walk right into their life? Are they proper? Baby, listen. Are they so my baby? Don't you touch me! Hey, I miss the kids. 
I miss us. I miss you. Let's go back to the way things used to be. <laughs> Let's go back to the way things used to be. God. Don't you dare touch me. Hey, hey. I made myself clear last night, Lita. <laughs> Hold on. You're serious with this guy? And so what? Hmm? Now you must be crazy, you know. You must be crazy shacking up with a divorced woman who has kids. Are, are, are you some sort of saint or something? What is your problem? It's not any of your business. Listen to me. I don't want to see you here again. Anywhere near how are the kids? Do you hear me? Now get yourself out of here now. you make an excuse for her. What is that? Because you're divorced, then what? You don't deserve happiness? You're her only child. And you've never been married before. It doesn't matter. What? I'm my only child and what? I'm gold? Please, it doesn't matter. I'm not going to let her have her way this time around. I'm a mother. I don't want you to fight with your mother. So you're not even going to greet your mother. Odi! Odi! Odi, I'm talking to you! Odi! 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 So what now? You're no longer going to spend your nights in this house? Odi, answer me. Mommy, what is it now? What, what, what do you want to say? No one will say that I should leave her because of you. I don't understand. What do you, what do you want from me? You don't approve of her? No problem, but I'm not gonna leave her. You don't even care about my feelings. What feelings are you talking about here? What feelings? What has this girl done with money? Tell me. She's divorced, so then what? What other crime has she committed? Odi. Mommy, listen. I'm not happy with you. That's the honest truth. I'm not happy. Uh-uh. Give you more credit than this now. Leaving. Mm, bye. You act for five minutes and your time is almost up. Sorry for wanting your husband. I'm sorry for taking you. I'm sorry for keeping the father of your children away from them. It's okay. It's not like you did it by yourself. Um, I and Boma are getting a divorce. Um, The doctor said I, I can't have children. Something about fertility issues. 
spend. Spend. We've been fighting over it and we've agreed to. We've agreed to just go our separate ways. Is that why he's been coming here? Because you guys are no longer together? It's fine. I have nothing against you. I hope life treats you well. Um, thank you. I'll be, I'll be moving to France next month. I might never see you again. I wish you all the best. I lost a true and very good friend. Because I'm selfish. Because I was selfish. And I will regret this. I will regret this for the rest of my life. Look, I, I don't understand what I you're saying. I can't, babe. What are you saying? So you want me to take you in because you can't see eye to eye with your mother? I don't want to stay there anymore. That's oh, what I'm saying. babe, come on. Don't do that to her. You mean the world to her. Listen, I'm so freaking upset with her right now. I don't want to be around her. That's... See, babe, I'm a mother. Okay? And I understand where she's coming from. I can't bear to see my two daughters shutting me out. I... Babe, she's not getting any younger. Let's not allow this be a threat to her life. All I'm saying is, let's not be dramatic about this. Let's but not she allow... doesn't want you. But That's... it's okay. She has good reasons. Wait, wait, wait. You want us to break up? No. All I am saying is that... Let's give her time. Let's not, we can't force her to accept us. Please. Please, babe. Yeah. I guess maybe you're right. I was a bit immature about it anyway. Thank you. That's why I love you, you know. <laughs> okay, so. Need yeah, I have to go. Back <laughs> home. I Thank you, babe. Thank you. Thank you. Mom. 
Mom, I'm sorry about my rash behavior. It's just that I felt bad. Because Adesua is the girl that I love, and... Mom, you may not accept us, but I love her. She loves me. We love each other. And that love is important to me. That's what matters. I'm sorry for hurting you. Good evening, ma. Hello, Can I come in? Yes, ma'am. Please oh. come in. Yes, ma um, so, how are you? I'm fine, thank you, ma. <laughs> so, what of your girls? They went to a party. I'm actually going to meet them there. Okay. Oh. You have beautiful daughters. Thank you, Ma. <laughs> You're going out? Yes. Um, okay. Um, do you want to come? Yes. What? I would like you to go with me somewhere first. Really? Yes. Okay. All right. So that's my story. It was really hard accepting my reality. And I never expected to meet someone like Odie. I, uh, I wanted to talk to you and say thank you to you. Thank you? For what? Odie is my only child, and he grew up having everything that he wanted. So he's quite good at throwing tantrums. You know, when he, he moved out and he packed his things, I expected that reaction. But what I didn't expect was the way he quickly came back to apologize to me. And I knew that that was your doing. I, I know that I've been so biased about your divorce. But when I heard your side of the story, I realized that it wasn't your fault. You know, I always pictured my son getting married to a single lady. Nothing prepared me for this. You know, Odi has has never been serious with anyone like you. Mom, you don't have to accept me. But I don't want to be the one who comes between you two. I have seen firsthand how much you love him. How close the both of you are. I don't want to be the one to ruin it because I love it. Mother, and 
My girls mean the world to me. I do so, darling. You can never ruin anything between us. Do you know why? Because you have a good heart. I now see the reason why Odi is so much in love with you. Mother. And you have won me over too. <laughs> You're the best woman for my son. And guess what? I give you my blessings. Thank you, Mother. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Oh, thank you so much. Mom, babe. <laughs> Come on, join the hog. <laughs> babe, your mom just gave us her blessing. What? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> my two most favorite people in the world. I love you. We should celebrate. Yes. Hmm? Pop chopping. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you want to help me in the Let's leave old people alone. Okay. All right. <laughs> Make something nice.